The Story of the Birth of Moses The sons of Jacob had moved down to Egypt. And many, many years later, long after Joseph had died, there were many Israelites in the land of Egypt. Their numbers grew, and so did their power and influence in Egypt. But a new king arose in Egypt, a new pharaoh who did not know about Joseph. And he looked and he saw how many were the Israelites and how strong they were becoming. And he said, I do not like the Israelites. They are too strong and one day they could threaten us. We must enslave them, make them build our buildings and our roads and our storage houses. So the Pharaoh sent out his soldiers, and his soldiers enslaved all the Israelites, whipping them and making them work very hard and living in poverty. But even then, the people of Israel continued to have many children, and their numbers grew. Pharaoh saw this and was angry Pharaoh commanded his soldiers to kill every baby boy born to the Israelites. And Pharaoh's soldiers searched throughout the land to kill the Jewish babies. One day, a woman from the house of Levi had a baby boy. She hid him, but when he was three months old, she knew that she could hide him no longer and she made a basket out of rushes and placed the baby inside of it. Then she put it in the river Nile and asked God to protect her baby. The baby's older sister stood at the riverbank and watched the basket. Now that day, the daughter of the Pharaoh came down with her maids to bathe in the river. And she saw the basket among the reeds, and she sent one of her maids to fetch it. When she opened it, she saw a baby boy. The baby was crying. She knew it was one of the Hebrew children, but she felt sorry for the baby and said, I will rescue this baby. Then her maid said, Who will take care of the child? The baby's sister, who had been watching, heard this and stepped out and said, Shall I go call a woman from the Hebrews to take care of the baby for you? Pharaoh's daughter said, Yes. So the baby's sister went and called the baby's mother. And the mother took the child and took care of him. As the child grew older, she brought him to Pharaoh's daughter, and he became Pharaoh's daughter's son. Pharaoh's daughter named him Moses, for she said, I drew him out of the water.